Hello, Goranges are on view and this time for our sale on the 20th of June and in the words of Kenny Everett, it's all in the best possible taste, starting with lot 150. How about that? A pair of composition, I believe. No, they're cast iron. Cast iron, semi-naked ladies. Lot 150, uh, beautifully painted, ready to go. Uh, next to it, have I got fire pits for you? Look at this. What an enormous fire pit. This is lot 172. I haven't got an estimate yet because I haven't got the tickets on, but um, based on the fact that we're normally selling the little ones for sort of two to three hundred quid, this would strike me as a sort of 500 to a thousand pound fire pit, and you're going to need plenty of logs to keep it going. But splendid thing. Well, what else do we have for you? How about this? I was admiring this. I thought this would suit um, me. <laughs> Dare I sit in it? No, no I'm not going to sit in it. It looks a little frail. But uh, lovely uh, sort of bath chair, I suppose. One could be pushed around in. Cane. Caning's gone there. Lot 186. Uh, furthermore, uh, we've had... That's interesting. Sidetrack here. This is a model that you used to see in hypermarkets in France in the 19... 90s, excuse me, that's a um, very important phone call coming in. Um, and um, you'd buy this like plastic suitcase and it would open up to a table and chairs. Well, here's a much earlier version of it, it looks like 1950s, like 193, it looks a bit creaky as well. Uh, then, well, not everybody likes these, I'm told, um, but uh, these animals hit the wall hard, as they say. Lots of taxidermy, uh, round about lot 200, you've got a whole host of African in the main horned beasts but also things like this wild boar here lot 206 and for the lady in chemo that i saw yesterday have i got bison horns for you look at that lot 182 um and then across the way there's a whooping great uh, water buffalo or what have you hanging over the doorway there so lots of taxidermy otherwise this is quite nice morning dave lot 181 morning dave on camera sorry okay. yeah uh, lot 181, nice bed that, this is sort of simulated bamboo, needs a base, needs a mattress, so you need to work that one out for yourselves, and that's not always the simplest thing to do, so do make inquiries before you purchase. Running on down the line, benches, stripped to wood suitcases, yes that chair's fun isn't it? Yeah I like that. Yeah nice, lot, lot uh, 55, mm. French I should say, walnut. Very nice. About 1890, 1900, but just nicely carved with those uh, lion's heads. If lion's heads are your thing, there's a lion skin rug over that way, yeah. lot 156. Carrying on. You car on. for you. Sorry, do what we Thank you, that's very kind. Good wood festivals coming up, that'd be perfect. Don't go too far. I'll look at that in the car park. Uh, here, lot 79. It was really the uh, upholstery caught my eye. I mean, okay, that's really faded, but its friend over the back is marginally less exhausted and, and has the has a has a motto inscribed on it lot so 79 lot 79 but they're a bit sort of battered i suppose uh these footstools have been all the rage uh we see a whole host of these coming through the cell these days lot 76 this one with this nice keelium upholstery various upholsteries have been appearing and if keelium's your thing there's some nice keelium carpets i'm going to squeeze through here uh, such as lot 132. I mean, they're brand new, I should say. Um, they've probably come in from uh, from a sort of warehouse or something like that. But uh, there's a mixture of them in different colours and they seem to fit with today's sort of decorative appeal. So that's those right down the end here. Just to finish here with, with the warehouse, if your name is Jenkins, you've left your trunk here. Um, and uh, Jenkins 2, no less. Jenkins 1 uh, hasn't left his trunk here. Um, and yes, yeah, this is nice quality, and it's not normally what we have, but lot 29 it uh, is a uh, very comfortable conservatory suite, and um, 20 past nine, gin and tonic, please. So uh, there we go, lots <laughs> of goodies fierce. in the warehouse. We'll go over the road and have a look and see what else is there. So in the main gallery here, how about some pictures for you? Lot 624, there you go, just it's a very sort of contemporary sort of thing. Modern, not signed by anyone in particular, with uh, Jamal is the name, 2004, but you know, decorative thing, no big money on it, 100 pounds or so. Otherwise, I was gonna show you, this is quite nice. It's very much in the manner of sort of 17th century German strong box. Um, it is lot 234, brass bound box, it says on this lovely old label. 
Um, it's pine rather than um, a harder timber. And I've seen some alterations. You can see these little chopped out holes in the back, but still, nice thing that. Keep your eye on that one. Um, there's portraits, there's children paddling in the sea. Again, that's a reproduction, um, but uh, just a nice decorative thing, 638. Host of different mirrors in the sail. And let's go and have a look at the smalls. In the smalls, let's do a random selection. I'll try not to select the things I always select because it's sort of, one does that. But how about lot 450? Which you'd always select. Well, would I? A mixture yeah. of encaustic tiles. They're so nice. But they are so nice, that's why I've collect, selected them. Thank you. Um, yeah, lot 450, nice lot. Look, you've even got a set of four there, otherwise you've got sort of random bits and pieces. Uh, next to it, wine, Chateau Neuf du Pape. Do I always choose wine? Yeah. Yeah, always choose wine. Okay, uh, what about um, pony mufflers? <laughs> They're too big for mocha. They are they dilly. Look, Hector. I can it's other beers, no less. Good God, what preference. Yeah, you can muffle the dog with those, I suppose. Seriously, what are they? Well, that's it there for putting on. What, 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 do you, what do you think? I don't know. A set of four. So they're for, they're for putting it's on a. Very a small horse. They're for putting on a hoofed beast. Well, goat mufflers. How bizarre. They're definitely for, for quietening them down or making them not create sparks, perhaps, if they're in a mine. Do you think? Could it be that? Anti explosion. I don't know. Maybe all is explained in the erudite cataloguing that's always provided by Goranges. We'll Lot 457. Like... We, the truth shall out. Uh, we should find what out. What about the. Um... Fossil. No, I don't particularly like that, but it, you know, some people do. Look, 452, uh, yeah. looks like razor clam fossil um, over the back there. Uh, naked ladies, never mentioned there. No, of course not. Um, Ormolu inkwells, we don't do four, that. Four, Cannons, no, not really. Let's shut some cupboards. Chairman Mao, he's fun. Lot 472, Chinese sort of bisque type ceramic of within the past 20, 30 years, probably maybe a little older. Imagine that would go quite well, 472. Nice quality blotter, look at that. Bool work, lovely, really nice condition. Lot 474, well, nice condition on the outside, bit tattered on the inside, probably made by Vickery. Yes, it is, look, there we are, Vickery. Impressive. Down the, impressive, I know. What's the um, inside? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, leather. So I need some work on the leather, but, but a nice, lo nice looking um, desk blotter there. Uh, then otherwise, Royal Crown Derby, paperweight animals. See quite a few of those. Lot 481, whole host in the lot. Some nice bohemian glass. Is it nice? It's okay. Lot 484, that's quite jolly. That overlaid goblet or vase, more like a vase, given the things of the room. You get a sort of Italian Murano type thing and two bohemian overlaid jobs with it. Uh, dolls, we, we always get freaked out by dolls. Uh, medals, uh, some nice scars down there. Let me go around. Oh, Hermes, 538. I should imagine they're Hermes, it says so on them. <laughs> Hermes, <laughs> I know you did. Uh, there we go, do you want to see it? Yeah. Uh, there we go. Pretty, isn't it? Pretty as ever, not a huge one, but uh, but with it you get. Oh, Is that another a... Hermes or? Well, you tell me, madam. If you held it still, I might not be able to. Not my department, Lacey Nickers. Lacey Nickers. Um, no, I. Uh... Oh. oh, it is Hermes, yes. It is Hermes, there we yes. go. So there we go, two, two nice Hermes silk scarves, usually about sort of 100 to 150 each. That's beautifully put back, well done. Put those back nicely. <laughs> Um, then we've got uh, a few weapons. There's a nice pepper box revolver, lot 512. Gosh. Looks like the action's working, but I'm not going to do it because you could break it and then everyone would be unhappy about that. Yeah, that's quite a nice thing. Um, that looks the part. It's not, it's just paste. All show, no go, as they say. Unlike 491, lovely Shuko motorcyclist in tin plate. Oh, that's nice. With its original box. So that's kind of sweet, isn't it? We like that, 491. Yeah. It's got a, its original key tucked away over the back. Nice. So there we go. As ever, a whole host of curiosities and wonders for you. Uh, so do come along. Well worth viewing this one for all the uh, things that you can go, good God, look at that. Who 
ever would buy that, but there's always somebody who will, and they'll point at something you like and think, oh God, that's boring. So, you know, each to their own. Uh, so come along and have a good look. Uh, enjoy this one. Fine sales coming up. We'll talk to you about that uh, next week. Thank you very much.